Hi, Rich Perlman from CigarCyclopedia.com, and today we're going to take a look at cutters, which is one of the most vexing parts of getting your cigar ready to smoke. Now, this is our first cutter. It's called a piercer, and it works like this. It's simply a sharp stick, like this, that you pierce the head of the cigar with in two or three different places, and that'll create a space for you to puff through the cigar. Our second cutter is a cigar punch, and this is a very, very famous one. It's called the bullet cutter. Our third cutter is easily the most elegant. It's the cigar scissors. This has been around for a long time, but it's not widely in use today. Now we have the guillotine cutter. You've all seen these, and most of you own them. It's pretty simple, but it works very well. It has a single blade in most cases, a double blade in some cases, and these work just fine as long as the blade stays sharp. If you're ready to move up in class, you might want to consider one of these beautiful Zycar cutters. They come in a whole series of different colors and styles, and they're beautifully engineered, as you can see. Here is the famous PG Signature Super Cutter, and the Super Cutter is probably the finest cigar cutter which has ever been produced. It's a single guillotine cutter, which means that there's a single edge which cuts across the cigar. But the blade width at the very tip is about one four thousandth of an inch. It was produced starting in the late 1990s. Only 2,000 were made by hand, and unfortunately, the fellow who produced them has passed away. Now, this wild devil is the Credo Synchro Cutter. It comes in its own wallet. So... All of your cigar friends are going to be pretty excited when you whip out your wallet with space for your credit cards and your ID and your currency, but you'll go to the back of the wallet and pull out your Credo Synchro Cutter. The next time we'll take a look at all of these cutters and see how they do when it comes to actually cutting. This is Rich Perlman for CigarCyclopedia.com. Thanks for watching.